Hello everybody, welcome back. I am D-Man and today I am playing Dark Souls. And some of you who have been around for my channel for at least a little bit might realize that Dark Souls is probably my longest running series that I've got thus far. Ten episodes, but they're all about a year old and uh, things have kind of changed. My abilities have either improved or gotten worse. I don't know, but... As it stands, I am going to be playing... Come on. Fucking enter. Uh, I'm going to be re-upping my log into the Dark Souls franchise once more. Alright, so I've got a character who is a hunter rather than a magic user because the magic system was either not as useful as I thought it was going to be or just didn't uh, do what I needed it to, so I decided I'm going to instead just do a ranged character, because ranged is my usual second go-to. Um, okay, start the game with this character. Yes. Get that off screen. The age of ancients, there was nothing but fog. Was shrouded by fog. As I just said. A land of gray crags. Yeah, don't worry. It'll it'll perk up when the rain comes. Never last it. Wow, that's a neat dragon. There's a lot of. It's just been a while since I've seen this opening. And with fire, aim disparity. And a long, long, uh, lifetime supply of cheese and crackers. Life and death. Fear and flatulence. We are in hell. Or California in the summer, it's hard to tell. It's hot then as balls in here. The dark, they came. Rob Zombie Enthusiasts. The souls of lords within the flame. This is an interesting thing about the Dark Souls series. I do not know a damn thing about the lore, and even the hardcore people don't know that much about the lore. This guy is all sorts of metal. But yeah, it's freaking hardcore. The witch of Isolith and her daughters of chaos. Like, the way I understand it is that these people were called to be um, some sort of sacrifice so that like the spark of life can happen, so easily forgotten, or so, so that, like the the Age of Fire can continue, like they were supposed to like sacrifice themselves so the Age of Fire could continue, or something like that. And they chose not to. And they, like... Yeah, I think that's what happened. And the whole thing is you're supposed to like either maintain the sac- like you're supposed to kill them to so that the flame can be reignited or something. I don't know. This is just all sorts of nonsense. This dude is fucking badass. He looks like this gigantic shrub. Ooh. See, he's just so... He's so fleshy. You gotta think he's gotta be super sensitive to the touch. Alrighty. Thus Lots. Began the age of fire. The age of fire and ice. Gondor! But soon or maybe it's Attack on Titan. This is Wal Maria or something. No, that would be Wal Rose as the center. Take that little ember. Well, she's pretty. I can tell this, even though I can just see her hair. But only endless nights. Well, he doesn't look so bad. Just put a band-aid on him, he'll be okay. Carriers of the accursed dark side. When there is no more room in hell, David shall rise and kill the zombies. Because it's cool. Because I'm super badass and edgy like that. The Wolf Ring. Alrighty. And 
uh, one of the th one of the main reasons why I yes, stopped indeed. playing for a good long time is because I had a day. failing hard drive, believe it or not, and it took me super super long to be able to get it and back and uh, not get it back, but get a new one. And so I replaced the hard drive. I got a solid state drive instead. Worth the update, but you know what you got to do. And um, the game runs much smoother. Things load up way quicker. And with any luck, it will also benefit my FPS. Because one of the problems in the original upload is that it was chicky as all hell. As you could probably tell if you've seen them, this is moving much faster much faster. Bye, rat. There's like a little army of bugs. The bugs go marching one by one. Hurrah, hurrah. Oh, she doesn't look so bad. It definitely could do better, but... Okay. Hey, buddy. You want to throw down a rope? Maybe you can help me. Or did... The question that I gotta ask is, what is that guy's motivation? Did he just throw me down, uh, throw that guy down there just in fear that he might raise up? Or did he throw that guy down there for me to eat? Or did he know I was gonna use that soul to kind of like... Well, he's obviously got a dungeon key, so one could assume that he's got the... Uh, that he put that in there for me to be able to figure out my way out. Alright, dungeon cell key... Camera controls, I know that much. Alright, right bumper is to attack. Okay. Right bumper, right bumper, right bumper, right bumper. Right bumper. And more souls. I'm gonna take you with me on an adventure. Get out of here. Alright, strong attack, right trigger. Okay. Yeah! Sha! And you gotta use... Left stick, plus hold B for dash. Okay. Tuck and roll is just a tap. Target, right stick. There we go. And... Sorry, buddy, but I need your soul. It's an interesting world this place uh, exists in, that souls are in some way a currency, and that life is almost perpetually dying, but the only thing that seems to be eternal are these souls that can come back. I don't know what the sis... Rested bonfires, recover HP. Would help if I actually got hurt. Alright. But it is a very unique um, world this place kind of live tries to live in. Alright, and I'm gonna be attacked real... In soon, so I'm just gonna dart through. Ah, that's what you get, bloaty. Don't worry, we'll come back to him later. I just knew what to expect, because that guy will fuck you up if you try to fight him. I've heard that if you're smart and careful, you can kind of be able to get him, um... There we go. Got the shield. Yeah, I change equipment. Offhand, I want my shield. Oh wait, that's not my offhand. There we go. Alright, there we are. Alright, left bumper. Okay. I'm gonna do this. Hiya! Yeah! Yeah! Ye. Did I get a sword? Or was I just given a shield? Am I just gonna have to fucking butcher this asshole? You know what? I like my. I like me a challenge. I'm just gonna see if I can find, like, a sword, something. Ouch. Ouch, kabibbles. Come on. There had to have been something. Maybe I just get the item behind him. 
He didn't seem to be capable of... Oh, he just ran. Durr. Short sword. Yay. Alrighty. We on ourselves a mission. Nice. Sucking up your soul. Pierce the ethereal twilight. Alright. I gotta watch out for the boulder roller. Yeah. Huzzah. See, I still got some skills. Oh. Very Jozu. You're no hollow. Hey. Hey, buddy. Actually, in that regard, is this the dude who gave me the uh, undead? With the key. Yeah, sure, I'll hear you out. I have failed in my mission. But perhaps there is an old saying in my family. I don't care. Undead are chosen. In thine exodus from the undead asylum. Make it what? To the land of ancient lords. What reason do you have and to tell me all this? Reason. It is Thanks just fantasy undead. gibberish, and it doesn't well, mean no. anything to me. Shut the fuck and up. I just want his stuff. Oh, one more thing. Here, Come on. An Estus flask. An undead, undead favorite. favorite. All right, fucking finally. Oh, and this. Now cool. I must bid farewell. I would hate to hurt. Farewell. <laughs> Why? Because you vexed me. All right, we're doing this. Alrighty. I'm not even gonna bother... Oh, wait. Most of those buggers that have respawned once I do that. Oh, well. I'm not going back anyway. Alright. And Pierce. That's what you get. That's what you get for being a jerk. For attacking me for no reason. Because you an a-hole. You just an asshole. Short bow. Change equipment. Oh shit. Dead. All right. So this is what I'm gonna do. Short bow. Come on, how do you... Ah, I see. That's not how you do it. Do I need... You know, it might actually help if I had fucking arrows equipped. That might be useful. Alright, so I'm gonna save it for... Uh, Senor Ugly. Pierce. Block. And... Pierce. There we go. I'm actually doing freaking... I'm on fire right now. Now we've got a real challenge. Come on, buddy. You want a challenge? That was me being stupid. Just so long as you can, like, nail him and keep going. Alright. So, I don't know whether or not I'm going to use bows against the big bro- Ah, oh, oh, damn it. Picked up a shitty sword. But I don't know if I'm gonna need to use bows against the big burly bastard, but... I'm gonna see if I can just keep out of his way and just kind of, uh, gorilla hit and run. Alright. Damn it. That was... Um, sorry. Sorry, I, I know these pots are, like, lovely and all, but... Um, how do I... Ouch. There we go. X. Okay. Gotta stay out of his...
damn. Ran out of energy. All right, so I gotta... Ah, damn it. Okay, hit and run might not be as beneficial as I thought. Okay, Estus up. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, didn't expect that. Okay. Estus up. Alright, maybe I can just... Damn it, I gotta go opposite to where he's slashing. Damn it. Come on. Whew! I can definitely do this. Oh, shit! Thank God I didn't take any damage from that one. No, that's not what I wanted to do! I don't know why I tried to block. Come on. Pudgy bastard. Okay, now he's getting desperate. He's gonna start using some weird tactics. There we go. Alright, so... The thing I tried to talk about in the last time I played this game was this game is not quote unquote like everyone kept saying that this game is super super hard that it's like one of the hardest games ever. Actually the truth of the matter is this game is not hard. Not hard in the traditional sense. This game is challenging but it's fair. It's not gonna fuck with you just because it wants to, or just because it has some sort of, um, like, difficulty spike or something like that, just everything is killable without leveling up. And I know this because I've seen, like, videos of people who are level one run through this game, just completely destroy it because they know the fights, they know how they work, and they can go through it without taking a whole lot of damage. There are some optional bosses that are impossibly difficult, but that's because just you gotta time it right, or they do insane amount of damage. But this game is not unfair with its difficulty. It's super, super fair. It just everything has a chance to take you very easily, but you have the ability just as much to take them out. So yeah. To the land of the ancient lords. Yay, land of ancient lords. Lordran. Lordran. The Lord. Lordran of the Lord Land of the Lord Hand of Lordran and the Land of Lords. More lords. We need more. More. I don't know what I'm talking about. Regardless, I got to the freaking save point, so I'm gonna end this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed everything. I want to welcome back my Dark Souls playthrough. And... Yeah. Welcome back to Dark Souls, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. If you didn't, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm D-Man. See you later. Bye-bye.